Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. First video of this new year, which reminds 2019 as year and how. Of late, you might have noticed that eyebrows have taken the center stage in the world of makeup. Perfectly groomed brows define your face. It can frame the face and if done correctly, it can act as an instant eye lift. How you shape your brows can define your look and give a lot about you before you even introduce yourself. They set up our eye area and make any eye makeup like your eyeshadows, your eyeliner, the mascara, etc. pop out and ensure that your eyes become the focal point on your face. Today's video is going to be about how to fill in your brows using eyebrow powder. You can also, uh, if you have an eyebrow pencil, that makes it all the more easier. But the basic steps remain the same. So this video is purely out of experience and I found that this way works for me all the time. So you might have thick brows, thin brows, curved brows, angled brows, straight brows, whatever the shape of your brows is. Just naturally follow the shape of your eyebrows. Follow the steps that I'm going to tell you and you will have the most naturally looking yet well-defined groomed brows okay so without much ado let's get started in this tutorial i have used an eyebrow kit a spoolie or a mascara wand a flat angled brow brush and a concealer this one's completely optional you might want to skip this okay so right now all i have done is um, have my foundation on and the concealer on Okay, that's it, nothing else. We will be doing this in five easy steps. Brush it up, fill it up, brush it down, fill it up and brush it up again. That's all. You might then want to follow it up with a brow gel and a concealer, but that's completely optional. Let's start with the first step. Brush it up. Use your spoolie and brush your eyebrows in upward direction uniformly. Step number 2. Fill it up. Pay attention to the direction of your natural hair growth. Now hold the angled brow brush at an angle similar to your natural hair and using the darker color of the two from your brow kit, sweep the brush as if you were doing tiny hair like structures in between your brows. Make sure you sweep your brush from the bottom to the top, blending it and following the natural curve of your brows and filling the sparse areas. Blend well. Remember to use light handed gentle strokes and you can even build it up according to your preference. Moving on to step number 3, brush them down. Use your spoolie and brush through the brows in downward motion. Step number 4. Fill them up. Now again, hold the angled brow brush at an angle similar to a natural hair which is downward this time and use a lighter color from the two from your brow kit and sweep the brush as if again you were drawing tiny hair in between your brows in downward motion. Make sure you sweep your brush from top to bottom this time following the natural curve of your brows and filling in the sparse areas. In case you have very sparse brows, you might want to map the area first according to your preference and then repeat these steps. Now that we're done filling them up, it's time to move on to step number 5. Brush them up again. This time, sweep your brush through your brows to evenly distribute the product. You can stop after step number 5, but in case you need to use the brow mascara or a brow gel, now is the time. Here I'm using the brow gel from the kit and using the same angled brush, I'm applying it in upward strokes. This gel will hold the shape of my brows and ensure longevity. Now again we can stop right here, but I will go a step further and use the concealer to accentuate my brows. Take the concealer on a flat concealer brush and trace the outline of your brows. Blend the edges for a flawless finish. Well, remember, 
we are aiming for natural looking brows so it's okay for some imperfections to show we do not want them to end up looking very unnatural and tattooed so it's okay go easy and go with your instinct in this tutorial i have used the eyebrow powder uh, but in case you have an eyebrow pencil then the steps from 1 to 5 still remain the same also if you do not have eyebrow kit do not worry you can still use any dark brown or ashy gray colored eye shadow or any color that is closest to your eyebrows to achieve the same effect all right there we go see the difference already chalo let's quickly repeat these steps for the other brow also well i know what you guys are thinking okay although the filling in of brows looks very time consuming with practice i bet you can hack these five easy steps in flat 30 seconds for each brow you know what that means if you are in a hurry with no time for makeup all you need is a minute to invest on those brows and you'll see all the difference it makes So you see they do give a natural finish does look very tattooed and yes looks very elegant So yes I did the rest of my face and I'm back um had I not done my eyebrows the look would have definitely been incomplete right So that's all for now guys I hope this tutorial was of some help Do follow me on my Instagram page be nice and do not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel I'll see you the next time Till then stay beautiful